another episode of Macy's Kitchen. It's now six o'clock in the morning. Time for a healthy breakfast. Macy, what do you have to say? smoothie. I have my coffee and it is, it is 9 a.m. for me. This is like a bit of an earlier start to the day, but today I am going to take you guys along my healthy and productive Sunday routine. I do want to start off by saying that if you are not crazy productive right now during this time, that is totally fine. I was just listening to a podcast and it said this isn't a productivity contest, this is a pandemic, and that's very true. But I'm still a full-time student and I have so much homework to get done today. Ever since I've been able to get work done on my own timing, I've kind of waited till Sunday to do a lot of it. I'm not very proud, but I'm gonna show you what my day looks like when I do have to do that because my to-do list is honestly slightly overwhelming. I haven't actually made it yet, but I... I'm gonna do that right now. I like to do my to-do list in order of what needs to get done. Like basically what is due the soonest. That way if I don't finish it, then it's not the end of the world. So before I get anything done today, school-wise, I really wanna post a video. I have it edited. I'm just having trouble with one little part. And then my to-do list is basically just things that are due either tonight or tomorrow morning. So that's all of this and then the begin list is things that I want to at least start, but it's okay if I don't finish them because these things are due Tuesday. Alright, I am now exporting my video. It took a little bit longer than I wanted. We are going to let this export and I am going to work out now. Okay, I changed and I am going to go do a Peloton ride right now. I think I'm just going to do like a 30 minute workout. But I just wanted to show you guys this workout set that I finally caved and bought. Here, I'll set you guys down. But this is just the Free People Movement set in the shade light blue. I don't think there's any other shades of blue. Maybe it'll show better in the mirror. But it is like the softest material ever in such good quality. And if anyone is looking for a workout set, I highly recommend this because it is like the best quality ever. So with my pink hair right now, I feel like it's giving off like major cotton candy vibes. But anyway, I am going to go work out. Here we go. Also, I just want to share this view out my parents' bedroom. It is like my absolute favorite thing ever. And it's so pretty out today. So the window's open and I am going to do a 30 minute ride right now. All right, workout is complete. I took a body shower. I didn't wash my hair because I did that last night. I changed into some comfy clothes and now I'm going to get started on my work. All right, after some very slow Wi-Fi issues and trouble editing at the end of the video, I thought it was just gonna be super quick. I'm finally posting this video. This is what the YouTube studio looks like in case you were wondering. And then I just made it public and we're gonna save. All right, I made a little ice latte and I have a snack and it is time to get to work on my schoolwork. Okay. 
Okay, I really don't know why I started off with like my hardest assignment. It was a research paper because usually I like to get the easier stuff done so that by the time I get to the harder assignment, I still feel like I did something, if that makes sense. But this time I started off with the hardest assignment and it took me so long and I only got one other class done, but I mean, it's okay. This is also an assignment that I waited till Sunday to do, so I guess it's my fault, honestly, but okay. We are going to turn this paper in, submit it, the best feeling. <laughs> I just turned in a few more assignments, but look at this. It is now four o'clock. Wait, where can, will it even focus my, okay, there we go. It's four o'clock now, and I wanted to show you guys my wallpaper. Will the song go away? Here, I'll just go to my album. Here it is, but I posted these on my Instagram story the other day because I just spent like a few hours one night making collages for my friends. This is one that I made for my friend Abby, but we like love all the same people. So I made it my wallpaper too. This is one that I made for my friend Kirsten. This is this is a mood board that I made for my friend Lauren. This is Lexi, and this was for Leslie. But I wanted to share those mood boards and collages I made because my friends posted them on their Instagram stories and I reposted them and a bunch of you guys swiped up and said that you love them and make a video on how how to make them so if you would like to see a video on how I make those mood boards and collages for your friends let me know and I'll do that but anyways I wanted to show you guys those mood boards and collages that I've been creating because I feel like right now is the absolute best time to get creative and learn new things and that brings me into who's sponsoring today's video which just fits so perfectly with this all so today I'm working with Skillshare and if you guys do not know what Skillshare is is it's basically an online learning community with thousands of inspiring and creative videos but I'm not kidding there is literally a video for everything and I feel like that's perfect for right now because we're all home with time to learn new skills and we have time to be creative which normally we're really busy and we don't have that time to take for ourselves but I thought that I'd just show you guys some of the videos and lessons that Skillshare offers and which ones I've been watching but as you can see I'm on the lifestyle videos right now and you will see that there are actually videos on every topic like embroidery, making a signature drink, journaling, which I've been wanting to get into. I really want to do this course, Finding Instagram Success, Build an Account People Care About, because I've been really trying to work on my Instagram. But as you can see, there are so many different topics that I feel like you guys would really benefit from. I've talked about it before, but I'm in a design class right now, so I'm actually going to show this on my computer. My design project right now is creating a brochure in InDesign, and I am not good with Adobe InDesign whatsoever. So I just searched InDesign brochure, and there are literally lessons on how to do my class projects. So whether you want to use it for actual school or just getting creative right now I think it is the absolute best thing I just feel like this Skillshare community is so helpful during this time and so uplifting but I really recommend checking out all the different videos that they have to offer and all the different topics because I can just guarantee that you will find something that interests you but if you guys would like to join the super inspiring and creative Skillshare community I highly encourage you to and with the link in my bio the first thousand people to click on it will get a free two-month trial of Skillshare premium but anyways I actually have to work on my brochure assignment right now because that is due on Wednesday. I even wrote that on my to-do list so I am gonna get to work on this for a little bit. Time to log into my Zoom for my recruitment workshop. I need to find which one I'm in. Group five? I feel like this is all my conversations now. Are you on Zoom? Are you logging on? Okay, I don't know if you can tell, but it's getting darker outside, and I have officially been sitting in this spot for too long, with like a few exceptions of getting up to get water. Anyways, it is now the time where I cross things off my to-do list and I see how much I actually got done. And then poli -sci, I should have actually moved that to my begin list because... That's due tomorrow night, and I know I should still do it, but I just did not get to it. Okay, now I'm going to put my priorities this week and just things that I know I need to get done. I've shown this planner before, but I love it. My mom got it for me. It's the 2020 goal planner, except I know we don't really need planners right now because we're not going anywhere, like, events-wise. But for schoolwork and social media, it's helpful, so I'm going to fill this out right now. But writing it out definitely makes me feel like I have a game plan for the week, so I would definitely recommend doing that on Sunday nights just so you know, like, kind of what you have going on. For example, on Tuesday... I register for classes for next semester. Don't even know what I'm going to be taking and I have to be ready. Also, I am going to share a treasure with you guys right now. My girl Kirsten that I'm living with next year makes amazing Spotify playlists. Like, please just look at how aesthetically pleasing these covers are. I listen to probably every single one and there's one for every mood. But anyways, I texted her at the beginning of this and I was like, where's the quarantine playlist as like a joke? And she made one for me and it says, shout out to Macy for this one. Oh, and stay home please. So, 
I am going to link this playlist down below and I want you guys to all follow it because it is so good and it is perfect. She somehow just like nailed all my favorite songs and it's just like easy listening music while you're just doing homework or whatever at home. So yeah, let's give her the credit she deserves and follow that playlist. I need to tidy up my room and eat dinner and undo a little night routine so that I can wind down before bed. That's something I've been trying to do. All right, everyone, I am officially ready for bed and I'm pretty proud of myself for how early I'm getting into bed. It's like my favorite thing. Oh, the lamp's all messed up, but it's like my favorite thing when it's just the lamp lighting. I don't know if you guys can tell. But yeah, I just have a lot going on this week, especially tomorrow, getting ready to register for classes and um, projects due tomorrow and Tuesday and stuff like that. So I am going to get a good night's sleep right now. Oh yeah, also I didn't film dinner, but we went in the jacuzzi afterwards and it was so nice, but it's 10 30 and i am gonna go to bed make sure you guys check out the link for skillshare down below and tell me what classes you guys like and make sure you subscribe and are following me on instagram because i would love for you to stick around but i love you all and i'll see you guys in my next video